Welcome back to my channel, it's Destroyer Deception, Pastor Kelly here with another video. Today's video, we will, talk, we will continue to talk about God Dietary Laws, Part 4 of Creeping Things. What are unclean foods? Or better yet, for Part 4, what are unclean creeping thing, creeping foods? <laughs> Alrighty, anyway, in order to begin to understand of the things that creep upon the earth, um, in some cases, things that scare us the most. What are the things that we should not eat that crawls upon the earth? Well, in order to find that answer out, we need to look at what the word of God says. In order to do that, we see that of all the creepy things on the earth, as we look at Leviticus chapter 11, verse 29 through 31, and 41 through 43 is going to give us a great picture of what is unclean that creeps upon the earth. So let's read Leviticus chapter 11, verse 29 through 31. These also shall be un unclean unto you among the creeping things that creep upon the earth, the weasel and the mouse and the tortoise after his kind and the ferret and the chamberlain and the lizard and the snail and the mole. These are unclean unto you among all that creep. Whosoever doth touch them when they be dead shall be unclean until the evening. And let's not stop there. Let's go on to Leviticus chapter 11, verse 41 through 43, a couple of verses down. And it reads, And every creepy thing that creepeth upon the earth shall be an abomination. It shall not be eaten. I'm going to read that again. And every creepy thing that creepeth upon the earth shall be an abomination, and shall not be eaten. Whatsoever goeth upon the belly, and whatsoever goeth upon all four, or whatsoever have more feet among all creepy things that creep upon the earth, them shall ye not eat, for they are an abomination. Ye shall not make yourself abominable with any creeping thing that creepeth. Neither shall ye make yourselves unclean with them, that ye shall be defiled thereby. Right? So, as you guys have looked at some of these pictures and so forth that were, uh, was shown unto you, you can begin to clearly see that the great examples of what the Lord has shown and summed up of, of what identify, identifying what are unclean foods unto us. And we can clearly see and many of us have had many questions about okay how do you really define uh whether this is unclean or that is unclean when the bible didn't specifically call out an alligator or a snake or a frog and so forth well when you go back and read the word now you clearly see it say whatever goes upon the belly and different examples like that to show us as you look at the pictures again the snake the alligator the crocodile all types of snakes all types of those things of frogs and centipedes and bugs and spiders and so forth and this and that to know that hey this is unclean you should not eat these things this is this is abominable and you should not make yourself abominable uh by eating those things um and so forth and those are the things that uh creep upon the earth that are unclean unto us like the video subscribe right now turn your notification bells on leave me a comment below tell me what you think if you need more uh questions you have more questions i'll do my best to answer or whatnot and share the video with whomever is in need Alrighty, it's destroyed deception pastor kelly and i'm out